Bilk, a former Tulsa police officer, will now spend time in prison. Jeff Henderson was one of four officers who will learn their fate today for their role in the well-known police corruption cases. Two News reporter Dan Perlman was just in the courtroom. He's live now with more. Dan? Well, Henderson was convicted on eight different counts. He was sentenced on all of them this morning, and he will serve time concurrently. That means for the next 42 months or three and a half years, he could be in prison. But sources close to him tell us they expect, because of time already served, he could be out in about 18 months. After that, he will spend about three years on supervised release. Now, Henderson originally faced 58 charges, but he was only found guilty on two counts of civil rights violations and six counts of perjury. U.S. District Judge Bruce Black oversaw the trial and passed today's sentence. In the courtroom, he said to Henderson, quote, you've had an exemplary career, but he also went on to say, quote, unfortunately, the Constitution does not allow cutting corners. Three others will also be sentenced for their roles in all of this today, including former ATF agent Brandon McFadden, former officer John or J.J. Gray, and former Corporal Harold Wells. Now, the courtroom upstairs was very crowded. Henderson had many family, friends, and supporters up there. Many of them burst into tears as the sentence was being passed. Now, we're going to be following this throughout the day, and we'll have more coming up tonight at 5 and 6. We'll also update you as the sentences come down on our website. That's KJRH.com. Live in downtown Tulsa, Dan Perlman, 2 News, works for you.